prepare the required hardware. Connect the three phase wires of the motor. Connect the power cable. Connect the motherboard to the PC with a USB cable. Connect the board and the encoder with DuPont cable. The interface correspondence is shown on the left. In this test, the 3.3 volts and GND and the SWD interface were borrowed. In practice, it can be selected according to the interface. Turn on the 24 volt power. Open VESC tool. VESC tool V3.0 is used in this example. The version of the firmware is V5.2. Click Auto Connect in the lower left corner to connect to the board. There is a display in the lower right corner if connection is successful. Click Setup Motors FOC below to configure the motor FOC. Select specifications according to the selected motor. Click Next to proceed to the next step. Modify the battery parameters according to the battery used. Click Next to proceed to the next step. Tick Direct Drive if no gears or wheels are fitted. If so, modify the parameters according to the actual situation. Then click One Detection No Con or One Detection. It will be calibrated later. This process is a bit long. Please be patient. After the calibration is completed, the motor parameters will be displayed. Then enter the encoder mode. Close the calibration page. Next we need to confirm the encoder data. Click on motor settings. General. General. The sensor port mode has been identified as AS50 for 7 encoder. Click on Motor Settings, FOC, General. Sensor mode is configured as encoder. Click the arrow button and RT button in the right column. Turn on the keyboard control function and real-time data updating. The UART function is selected in the APP to use to make the keyboard control valid. Then we can use the arrow keys to control the rotation of the motor. Open data. Real-time data. Rotor position. Encoder. Encoder data can't be observed. At this time, manually toggle the motor you can observe the corresponding changes in the encoder data.
set the input duty cycle to 1%. Changes in the data can be observed. At this time, the motor also starts to rotate. Set the duty cycle to 20%. Data changes again. The speed of the motor rotation also becomes faster. Set the duty cycle to 50%. Data changes. The motor turns faster. Set the duty cycle to 90%. The data changes, the motor rotates faster. This is the end of the example. Thanks for your watching.